Next, we're going to discuss the stitch width and the stitch length. These are the two most common things that you're going to change on the sewing machine more than anything else depending on the garment, the fabric, and the type of stitch. For me on my machine, my stitch length is this symbol right here and typically it is this symbol on most machines and my arrows control it and my stitch width is this symbol where my nail is and the arrows will control it. So if I increase my stitch width, you can see on my little screen that I'm getting wider and wider. And if I'm at zero, I have no width and I'm only going straight. Same up here with my stitch length. If I increase it, my stitch length is getting longer, such as for basting instead of using the typical 2.5 or going smaller for something like stay stitching. So I'm gonna leave mine at zero and 2.5, which is the suggested settings for my machine as they are blacked out. 